Ooh, it's signed on the bottom. Now, can I read that? Alrighty, well, today we are at the Habitat for Humanity Restore in Albany, New York. Um, today is 25% off everything, so we should be able to find something to resale. Let's get in there and see what we can find. Alrighty. All right, so the first thing we see are these crystal wine glasses. Um, I can't tell if they're cut crystal or not, but it's $80 for the set of four eight glasses, and it's 25% off, so I think we're gonna get those. But look at these plates over here. I like that. Look at the gold and the blue. 15 each. 15 each, so we're gonna have to take a look at those and then this. You have the chocolate pot back there. It has like a blue floral design with a gold. That's a good condition too. So we're gonna have to take those out. All right, well, I see some cute stuff over here. Oh, it's a big crack around the neck. Oh, about this teapot? Yeah, teapot. It's $12. There's a little repair in there. And then we have this ashtray. It looks like a leather underneath. It's a tool leather. It's only $2. I think I'll get that. Then we have this elephant creamer. From distance, I thought it was Shawnee pottery. Oh, there is a mark on the bottom. Well, let me figure it out. All right, so this is Shawnee pottery. Um, it sells for about $10 though, so it has a little uh, manufactured defect there, so I think I'm gonna leave it. I know it is cute. I don't know, maybe I'll just get it. <laughs> oh boy. Oh, we have some wooden apples. Made in Haiti. That one's different from these. Hmm, I don't know about those. See if there is anything new down here. Oh, this bowl. It looks like it's hand painted. Is it? Yeah. Hand painted for the F A M France. Huh, I'll get that for a dollar. So we've got the Shawnee Pottery Pig and the bowl. We've got that before. And we have this bowl. Um, I don't know the that name. It kind of looks Greek to me. It's definitely hand painted, so that's only two dollars. A little tiny, tiny chip. So we'll put that in the cart. Let me go get a cart. All right. So there are the crystal wine glasses. We're also getting this Majolica plate. Um, it says Majolica on the back. And this is a uh, antique, I believe French. There is a repair right there, but we still make money. It's only $5. <laughs> less than that. Yeah, less than $5. I found this Mexican pottery. Ooh, oh, um, look at that. Mm. Two cup. Yeah, look at the floral on that. Ooh, let's see the mm -hmm. bottom. Oh yeah, how much is it? Three dollars. Less than three. <laughs> I like this fish mug. Something JC Mex Mexico. Oh god, I have to get that for a dollar fifty. A Mexican mug. 
with a fish on it. Yeah. I don't see any yeah. chips. That goes in there. Let's see if there's anything else I spot. Not Mexican. It's made in Italy. Oh, is it? You think it's worth just one mug? I would say if it was a set of, at least a set of two, I would get it. Unless it's like a big mug like that Mexican fish one. Thought maybe that could have been a fuss story. We just sold the glasses that look like that. Here. Looks like a bit maybe a beer mug. Fire department beer mug. Oh, that's pretty with a purple. A little bit older. Oh wow, somebody burnt their coffee in there. Over here we have a uh, Lusterware, teapot, creamer, and sugar. It's a kind of off yellow. It's $15 for the set. Let's look over the teapot a little bit. It's um marked on the bottom Victoria check. So I'll be about $10. I think I'm gonna do that. Yeah, why not? Here. That's pretty. Staffordshire. And it's numbered, so it's probably an antique. I'm gonna get that for a dollar. On, we have a butler's pantry. And we display all of our antique pieces in there. Some brass, it's $20. Oh, this one's different. That's a little bit of an art deco look. And it's extremely heavy, oh yeah. $12 for the pair. Made in India, hmm. I don't know, we usually sit on brass. But if I get it cheap, I'll pick it up. Computer. It's in this little bag. Ooh, we have all these dolls. Four dollars each. Oh, look at the nurse. I don't know about these. That one is a little bit older. Think. See, I don't know too much about dolls. Look at this nun. Huh. I wonder if they're marked. Let's see. It's usually on the neck or the back. Hold on, I can't read it. Okay, so I think I'm going to take a chance on this. I'm going to get the bride. Um... Let me get the bride. The St. Patrick's Day one. What about this bride? I think I'll leave her. I'm gonna get the nun. The flying nun. <laughs> Alright, I think that's it for the dolls. Twelve dollars are probably a longer burger. Yeah, $12 and 35, it's 2003. This one, I feel like the one with the wooden lid or with a lid sell more. I can't do 20 on that. I feel like that's like a $40 sale. This one may be a little more, but that's 22. I don't know. That has a plastic top though. So I'm gonna wait for those to go on sale. 
I should hide us somewhere. Maybe under here. <laughs> Kidding. <laughs> oh, some poker. It's only 20. Game of Thrones trivia game. Ooh, I wonder about the Monopoly. I know some people collect these. It's collector's edition. Only thing with games is you have to make sure all the pieces are there. It takes a while to list and could sit on it for a while unless it's desirable. Let's take a look at these vases. Oh, uh, look at this one. It's almost like the daisy button. Little bud vase. This one's different. It's almost like an abstract. Any markings on the bottom? No. That's neat. This one is crystal. Kind of like that one. It has the pinwheel. Look at it shine through the light. And we have some milk glass. I don't know who made that. Maybe Westmoreland. I don't know. I always look through the utensils because you do find some stuff in here. Ooh, looks like it might be silver plated. You have that and the spoon. Look at the back if there's any markings. Oh, there is. Looks like three crowns. I'm gonna get those. What else do we have? That definitely has age to it. All right, I'm not seeing anything else. I always look at stuff that's in the box. It's a juice fountain. $20. Um, I don't think that's new though. Yeah, that's used. Oh, if it was new, I feel like that would sell for $90, $100. I think used would be like $50. It's just back here. We have a stone and then. Oh, it's a light. That's three dollars. That's not too bad. Look through some crystal. This one caught my eye. Let's see if it's marked Waterford. It's hard to see. I don't see the mark there. Have a bubble pattern. Anything down here? Is that Finland? No. about these plates? It's just some fruit on there. I haven't checked out the figurines in a while. This Asian lady. Oh, both her hands are broken off. Man. I think these were made in 1940s or 50s. What about the space saver? I know some of the corning sells well if you see the sunflower. We have a pizza. Ooh, what about this? Some mushroom. Almost thought it was the spice of life. If some damage there. Yeah, it's missing the whole handle. I know these could sell well. The meat chopper, grinder, but that one's broken. Right over here we have a candle burner, a wax burner maybe. It's a 
only five dollars. Yeah, I don't know about that. You can use that as a mug. You have to hold it like that. <laughs> but this pottery back here. Oh, it's broken. Oh, that would have been neat. Too bad. You can always glue that back on. I don't have time for that, though. Certified International. Kind of neat. Let's take a look at this canister. I don't know what that says. Maybe MHV. I don't know, I like it. It's pretty with the floral design. It's hand painted. Ooh, a lot of chips. Ooh. What is it? Ooh. What are those strawberries? Yeah. Oh, that one is too. Oh, it is. Yeah. Uh, let's call the hot air balloons. Okie dokie. 50% off children's clothing. Let's see what those blue vases are. I like those. This little gold. I don't know what. Um, is that a wolf or a lion? Ten dollars. All right, let me get a cart. Ooh, what about that? I don't know. Fourteen ninety nine. Let's look at this little tray. Oh, it's delft for one ninety nine. I don't see any chips. I'll put that in. Oh, that one is too. What does that say? Oh, it has a face on it. Yellow house. A little crazy, but I always like Dolph. I'm put that on. I don't know how much that would go for. But. Ooh, look at these. 99 cents. It's not marked. Oh, that's pretty with the gold. Hmm. And it looks like it's hand painted. I don't know. Let me think about that. Oh my god! Hmm. Oh, Starbucks. Alice and Olivia. Now this is one. Oh man. That's a big scratch. Does that come off? Oh well. A little sugar without the lid. Oh, ooh, let's look at this tin tray. Made in England. Sherwood Studio. I'm gonna have to look this one up. Now, do I have a box this big for it? Let's put it in here. What about this little tray? Look at that. It's plastic. I thought maybe it was wood. I'm gonna leave it though. This milk glass. Fire King. What about the plate underneath? Oh, this is Germany, but I don't see too much value in this one. life. 
Ooh, look at this little penguin. I've seen this before. It's a bank. Hey, what is this? Ooh, look at this doggy. Oh, I like that. Made in Japan. Oh, it has a bird on it. Definitely looks like made in Japan. Three ninety nine. Oh, that's just gunk. Put that in. No, I don't know about this. I have a lot of chips on it. I'm going to leave it. It's a pottery. Snowman. Oh, those are cute. Joy cheer. Piano baby there. Ooh, what's this? Now oh, that's wood. Oh, it's an ashtray. Four ninety nine. Hmm. Let's put that in. That one I'm gonna look up later when I'm not in anybody's way. This house. All right. Ooh. Let's see what this is. I don't see any marks. I could always do a Google lens search. Yeah, that's crazy on the bottom. Probably older. What about this uh, mosaic? I thought it was a mosaic. Ooh, it looks like it has some age. It's hand painted. I don't know. Fish down here. Plastic. It's an interesting Santa mug. Nantucket. What about this? That's pretty. Tomatoes? Is that a tomato? I don't know. They have some collector plates with a nice butterfly on it. It's pretty. I don't see too much value in those. Gibson. Wine glasses, plastic with some glitter on them. Up this. Hmm. Dennis East. What's the price on it? I might have to look that up too. So this sells for uh, $28. Uh, someone did a best offer, so I'm going to guess like 24 to 20, 20 to 24. We got to get a price on that though. Ah, don't break. Okay. Look at these blue mugs. Ooh, that's a good brand. Okay, so I'm gonna get a... I mean, it has a tiny chip on there. I'm gonna get this one. This one. Should I just get all four? Yes, all of them have chips on the, the rim, so I'm going to leave it. Man. Okay. Look at these piggies. <laughs> Little Red Riding Hood. It's a bookend. 
That's just one. How about this? Ooh, it's signed on the bottom. Now, can I read that? I cannot. $7.99. All right, we'll research that. Oh, something fell out. Ooh, a snow globe. Ooh. Trying to figure out what that is. Or what building that is. I know it's a church. I don't see a price on it. Hmm. Let's put that in. Get this uh, Roadrunner. <laughs> Stoneware. I don't know. I don't see a brand on it. We have Mom. Gravy Boat. This one looks different. It's a stone. I think it's a soapstone. But we have that big repair on the edge. What about this bowl? Better homes. It's pie plate or pie dish. Family heritage. All right, let's move on. And we have some tins up here. They're French. Oh, from Best Buy. Ooh, what about that? Ooh, that's pretty. A little damage there. I wonder if that matters, though, for this. And it's cracked. Oh, I love it, though. Look at the enamel. All right, put it back, Jeremy. <laughs> Where are you? Karam Rashid. Alright, I think I'm gonna throw these in. A little bit of scratches, but I don't really have time to look it up though. So I'm going by my instinct. What about this little vase? Made in Japan. That's nice. Is that supposed to be Mary? It's hand painted. Throw that in. What about these porcelain lamps? Ooh. Uh, $30. That's about right. But you have the lady um, dancing with a tambourine, and then he's playing that. Yeah, maybe if they're half off, they might still be here. Some brass lamps. I think you want the Baldwin. I think that's right. <laughs> All right. So this gravy boat, I think I have the matching underplate. Not for sure, not for sure though, but I think I'm going to try it because I still have it at home. I wasn't going to list it. I don't know who made this one though. Look at this. Hmm. How about this leaf back here? Ooh, look at that. I'm still not sure about these. Watch me be leaving behind like a thousand bucks. <laughs> that would be my luck. 
All right, so they're about to close. This is everything we're getting. All the Delft and the salt and pepper shakers. A little doggy planter. Gravy boat. All right. Alrighty, well, our total spend at the Salvation Army was $30. Uh, we could get our money back just off of the Made in England uh, tray. And I can't wait to research this a little more. I spent $8 on it. There's the marking. So, I feel like I get more than $8 for that. It's heavy. Alright, say so I'm going to get home and try to list some of these items and the items from our last video. <laughs> We've been slacking a little bit, but we'll get to it. All right, I'll see you next time. Bye.